Hi, well I decided to incorporate the enclosure base into the actual stand itself. So uh, basically the difference from the, as far as dimension wise, uh, this piece of wood right here uh, was originally 48. I trimmed it down to 45 because this piece is going to be right here. I trimmed this down to 22 um, because of course these would be right here. So. Uh, I'm going to go through how I put that together, all right? Okay, I'll start off by saving this, giving this a name. I'll call this Stand 1, and click Save. And I will start by adding the 2x4x36, by by the upright pieces of wood. I'll leave that one right there, zoom out. And then I'll add three more. Put this one over here. Enter. And two more. And then I just need the cross pieces. And the two shorter cross pieces. These will actually form the uh, the bottom shelf uh, where the uh, water reservoir will be for the uh, flood coolant. Okay, cool. So now I just have to go to the bottom here. All right, and go to Modify, Align. I will modify, uh, align this with this here, and this with this here, and this with here, and this one will go here, and this here, and this one will go here, and finally this one will go right here. And go to home view. All right, we have the uh, the bottom basically done there, um, but I actually want to leave it uh, these to be up off the ground a little bit, so I'm going to go to Modify, Move, and I'm going to select Modify, Move, I'll go to Modify and Move, and Move Components. I will select one, two, three, and four, and I will raise those up by one inch, one, enter. And there we have it. All three of the braces uh, have been moved up one inch. All right. Okay, so the next thing to do is to add the wood up here, so I will bring those in. Need two of these, one enter, and then one more. Enter, and two of the 
2 by 8 by 22s. Move this over here, hit enter. Okay, let me go to the top here and go to modify, align, select here and here, and here and here, 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 and just like that. Click OK. Alright. So the next thing I need to do is put the two braces in right here. And to do that I need to uh, do a sketch underneath here. So I can align it. So I go to sketch, uh, line, select, here's the plane, and find the center, which is the triangle, and there, uh, go to sketch, offset, Move this out of the way. Select here. And it was uh, 4.25. Enter. Repeat offset. 4.25. Enter. And stop sketch. And I don't need that, so I'll delete that. Okay, so next thing I need to do is bring two of the braces. Those are the, let's see, 2 by 6 by 26. And bring one of those in. And one more. Enter. Okay, let me go under here. Modify. Align. From here to here. And here to here. And okay. Alright. And I will turn off the uh, sketch by... Oops, sorry. Uh, sketch, turn the sketch off. Alright. The next thing to do is to uh, put the plywood in. Alright. Okay, well the rest of, the, of this is basically the same as the previous video, so I won't go into that. So, alright, that's it. Oops. Sorry, I forgot one thing. Forgot to put the plywood on the bottom. I'll just grab the bottom plywood here. And drag this up a little bit. Hit enter. And modify a line. And you can actually select not just the top corner there, but the bottom corner right there. So I'll select that and this point right here. And hit OK. And that's it. All ready for the... Uh, for the, I'm just going to use a bucket uh, to hold the water for the uh, flood coolant. So, alright, that's it.